<laughs> you never know, baby. maybe I'm the next million boy, you'll be surprised. <laughs> I want the next time I come here, you should have, you, you can even start modeling. You never know. You can even, the problem is, what do you think about my sister? Can she be a model? Look at her. She's. Hello, guys. What's up? What's up? Our beautiful people. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today is very special because uh, we thank God for the rains, we thank God for the good life, we thank God for everything. So, for those people who have been requesting like, uh, your sister, your sister, your sister, your sister, your sister, your sister. Today, I'm here with my sister, my blood like sister. She's the firstborn in the family, but she, she looks younger than me. So welcome, and uh, if it's your first time here, join our family kindly subscribe to our youtube family for you to support us and uh for you to be part of us and for my returning viewers thank you so much for look at the road so when i grow up and i become rich i think i'll make this road possible to my to my home so guys i'm gonna introduce uh, my special sister to you <laughs> it's not me Wayne. 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 <laughs> so, uh, no, what's your name? Like real name? My real name is Wayne Bag Mabere. Mabere. Yes. So she's uh, uh she's the firstborn in the family and uh, I think she looks more like mama. And people tell me what do you mean for mama sana? But unfortunately you never saw my dad. Our dad. I look more like our dad more. And uh, Roby, uh, Wayne, looks more like uh, my mom. So we're gonna have just uh, a conversation, a normal conversation, eh? like uh, just to show you because I know her just for YouTube, just for fun. So maybe we can ask her uh, what she does for a living. You can just start from there. So, a uh, what do you do for a living, maybe, to tell people? Okay, I'm just hustling. Mm -hmm. What kind of hustle? I'm a cleaner in the bank. In the bank? Eh, hey, when somebody hears in the bank, <laughs> they feel you are a millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. Uh, years ago, my mother used to work as a cleaner in the bank, but she got sick. They, uh, they used to pay her 50 US dollar less than that a month yeah and now when she got sick my sister took the position now she's working as a cleaner in the bank at what time do you wake up maybe to go to work I wake up in the 6.30 at 6.30 yeah. and at work you arrive at 7 no you arrive at 6.30 oh you are supposed to be at work at 6.30 yeah and then uh, you at what time do you go home in the evening 5.30 5.30 and uh, maybe more or less how much do you earn a month? Imagine 8k 8k that is uh, 8,000 Kenya shillings yep. and um, 8,000 Kenya shillings that is close to 70 US dollars USD 70 USD 70 euros so uh, you take lunch at the bank? No we are buying with your own money you buy food with your own money yeah so how do you survive with that? Tell, tell me, just just tell me, maybe for the sake of uh, uh, my subscribers or people who are watching us, you, you are doing this video to motivate others, not for any other purpose. How, how, do, you, how do you survive with 8,000? How much is your rent? My rent is just only 2,000. You pay 2,000 for rent, that is uh, 20 per euros per month. Yeah. Uh -huh. And food? like food sometimes i do survive without eating you survive without eating yeah at, <laughs> lunch times, lunch ah, at work at work yeah <laughs> but why do you survive without eating uh, but but you have the rest of the money you can eat no. like 60 years rajambo mugita mwana ga ona maru mugita ani ko hetori ka hara hasu gutu na to hetere ka hi eh ta wa sawa ka yeah, on a serious note, uh, so you survive sometimes without eating. Yeah. Because I understand with uh, 80,000, that is 
no, 8,000, not 80, 8,070 USD, close to there, US dollars. And you are a girl, you have to make your hair. Yeah. You have to do your shopping, and so it's a little amount of money. Have you ever thought maybe, uh, what do you do apart from, because me, I know what you do. For the sake of my subscribers, eh? Yeah. What do you do for, apart from uh, maybe, because I understand that money is very little. Yeah. to survive so what do you, what else do you do maybe to get pocket money to make sure your house is not closed i do so, i do selling clothes <laughs> i'm sell a clothes. hawker when i'm um <laughs> when i'm from art job uh -huh. i do selling clothes mtumba so you sell you, you sell clothes yeah so my sister sells clothes when she's from work she sells second hand clothes maybe one clothes at one euro two euros that's what she does and uh the good thing is that we grew up together. Do you remember when we used to eat one mandaz with Discola to go yeah, back to school? Of course. <laughs> yeah, so we grew up together and I hope that one day, maybe, uh, I want to tell you her story so that you feel, uh, what, you know what's going on. Eh? Yeah, she never completed high school because of one, two or three reasons because uh one or two or three reasons and uh, uh, school fees everything so honestly she never finished high school because a lot of reason family a lot of reason you know because we are raised in a very very challenging background and it's normal sometimes uh one can fail sometimes but i feel like uh life has has second chances you get it so that's why we are struggling like uh, I'm the one uh, I'm like the breadwinner but I thank God when I used to be even in my wedding she's the one who like uh, bought us clothes yeah without her job so she bought us clothes uh, she's the one sometimes I could call back in school she could even uh, send me some money for food yeah so I feel like maybe life has second chances it's not that when you never finish school, now that is the end of you. And uh, that is what I always tell her as uh, his young brother. And I believe uh, one day, one time, maybe his, her life will change. Maybe, have you ever thought maybe uh, being into business or something like that? Yeah. What kind of business? Maybe, you know, you, don't, you never know. Maybe I'm the next millionaire. <laughs> you never know baby. maybe i'm the next millionaire and i will i might even decide to open a you uh, open for you a very big business here in the village you never know because i believe dreams are valid me i dream and uh I, or you know you know god bless somebody you know i want that uh when i'm raising up you know the moment i've not started like i'm, I'm still looking at mom so maybe somebody might say uh why don't you send you? you might, me, I've, I've never, maybe for a, a little amount of money. I can count the money that I've sent to my sister. It's not even close to a, a, a hundred euros. You get it? Because uh, of our mom, we have to take care of our mom, we have the bills to pay, everything. But when this, maybe, so I was saving maybe for the house. We want our mom to be in a good house. We, uh, we want to open a business for her. Uh, the video is coming out. But I believe maybe one day, uh, like a brother, you know, I, I like when uh, I'm raising, Jose is raising, you are raising, Teddy is raising, so we raise all. Because I believe when, even if you are a millionaire and you are maybe the breadwinner in the family, it gets, it gets, we can go to mama's business. Uncle, Shikamo, Shikamo. Ah, so it, Auntie? Mama Cynthia. Ah, so, so guys, uh, I'm telling her, even if you earn a million shillings and you are alone in family, it's very hard. But when I earn like 20,000 Kenya shillings and you earn 15, we raise all of us. So maybe in future, when God bless us, maybe you never know, maybe I might be a millionaire in your hands. <laughs> yeah, and maybe you can work together like a business partner. And you also, maybe, you might be a millionaire than, uh, maybe earlier than me. You know that is possible. Of course. Yeah, because 
money is uh, is you can make money if you went to school or not going to school is just like you have to go to school to pass through the system but also people have made it i can give you an example here in the village uh maybe those people you see uh, you know a lot of people who have made it uh, without finishing. yeah without finish so me i always encourage you that uh, like don't take don't see that maybe we schooled more because we are still younger than you and you can always uh, come with suggestion ideas to to build because hamza for those who don't know this is hamza, hamza's mom yeah my nephew the one that is always there in my videos this is hamza's mom i take hamza as my brother and also my son so she's my sister she's working in the bank and uh, look my I outfits. I think you could be a, a model. <laughs> yeah, I think you could be. <laughs> my outfit. Yeah, I think my sister could be a model. She, it's possible. You know, we can work uh, on ourselves until you people you'll be surprised. <laughs> I want the next time I come here, you should have. You, you can even start modeling. You never know. You can even, the problem is, what do you think about my sister? Ebuku diapa dog. Can she be a model? Look at her. She's nice, my baby. Look, we are the same size. She's very tall. Yeah, so I think she can make a very good model. Maybe the next time she will be the top model of, of Gucci. Yeah, <laughs> Balenciaga. <laughs> <laughs> because it it can happen. It can happen. It's only going to school, maybe one, two, three, and do uh, some training and you're good to go. But also business. I always encourage you because I always encourage you to try business and it's good that you are trying to sell some Mutumba second-hand clothes but uh, once I finish with my mama's house you also know my brother Jose I have a plan for him like and even you, you I always have a plan for you you know like a small because I, I always want all of us to win it's not that when I'm not supporting you now it's like I've forgotten about you and I'm always encouraging you it's possible to make it even without school. At your age, you can make it. You can become the top millionaire in, in the, even the world. Because it's possible. But the reason I'm, I'm making this video is not because even of that story. Because I don't want like, to, to talk to... It's like a, a talk to my sister. Yeah, I wanted the world to know my sister. She's our firstborn. And uh, she's beautiful. She's hardworking because... Now that his brother is maybe in Europe, he has never like said, my brother is in Europe, I'm not going to work. She cleans the floor, guys. But uh, the, f in the future is always bright. But and we believe as a family, we will all raise and become a big, big family. So guys, we're going to like in the shop, we're going to take something for her and then we see how it goes. So guys, we took a motor because we are heading, my mother sent us to pick some stuffs so so this is my sister and I believe that one day everything will be okay because the best thing is that uh, she's healthy and uh, other things will follow so Andy <laughs> so guys let us go and uh, pick some stuff that we are supposed to pick and we go back home